an electron can accelerate to very high speed even in the potential energy difference as small as that from a 9 volt battery. If we imagine an electron starting at the plate of a battery at 0 volts and because there's an electric field wherever there's a change in voltage being accelerated over to the right we can ask how much will it be how fast will it be moving as it reaches the right hand plate. In a sense this is a conservation of energy problem because what has started out as a potential energy on one end ends up as a kinetic energy on the other. And the potential energy in this case is Q times the voltage difference because we remember that voltage is defined as the change of potential energy divided by the charge. So that initial potential energy is exchanged for the final kinetic energy, or 1 half mv squared. If we want to solve for the velocity, the velocity is then just the square root of 2 times the electron charge times the voltage difference divided by the mass. If we put in some numbers, the electron charge is 1.6 times 10 to the minus 19 coulombs. We're saying that in this case the voltage difference is 9 volts and we remember that the electron mass is about 9 times 10 to the minus 31 kilograms. Very quickly we can see that this will be a very big number. This is approximately 10 to the 1, this is 10 to the minus 19, so that's about 10 to the minus 18 in the numerator. This is about 10 to the minus 30 in the denominator, so it's about 10 to the 12 inside of the square root. When we take the square root, though, 10 to the 12 becomes approximately 10 to the 6. And in fact, in our calculator, uh, the final answer comes out to about 1.8 times 10 to the 6. So it's a very fast-moving electron. If you remember that the speed of light is approximately 3 times 10 to the 8 meters per second, this is about 1% of the speed of light.